Welcome back guys, hope you're doing great and today's in this video, I'm going to show you the beauty product app which we are going to learn in the upcoming tutorials. Well, this is just a brief introduction of the tutorial what we are going to build in that specific course. All right, so we are going to build a hybrid application by using expo sanity.io and we are going to use the Redex in this tutorial. Well, you can able to see we have this nice onboarding screen which is custom built. We are not using any packages or anything. We built this onboarding screen completely from the ground. We are having three different kinds of screen. Well, basically onboarding screen will be loaded only once at the time when you are opening the app for a very first time. So you can able to swipe it or you can able to swipe back and forth. And once I reach the last screen, that will immediately jump to the landing screen of our mobile application where you can able to see all the product which is lively coming from our sanity. You can see this is the live URL where I can able to add the and manipulate the products and everything. All right. So here you can see all kind of all categories of products. Well, if you want to filter it out. So if you want to filter very specific product that you want to search, so I can able to search for a very specific product which matches that specific term. All right. If that term doesn't match, so that will gives you the no data. Basically, we need to use any SVG to make it more interactive user interface. All right. In this case, I'm just displaying no data. Maybe we can customize it on the build during the build. All right. So we having this nice filtering options and of course we having this bottom tab navigation as you requested well basically this bottom tab navigation is also custom built we are not using the inbuilt navigation tabs so these uh, bottom tab navigation is custom built and you can see it's currently the home screen is active that's the reason it's showing as the home as an active tab if i want to switch between different screens so currently the cart screen is active so it's showing the cart as an active tab so this option is also added in our bottom tab navigation well, if I want to tab any, let's say if I open any specific product, all I need to tap this card. So that will takes me to that very specific product screen where I can able to see this nice UI uh, with the background image and the product image and we having the different categories, the descriptions and the name of the product, what is the price. And here I can increase the quantity and I can't decrease the quantity less than one. It doesn't allow the user to reduce the quantity less than one. And if I wish to add this product to the cart, all I have to do is to hit the cart. So that will be added to the cart. All right. So let me get back to the previous screen. Let me add a few more products over there. So add this product. Uh, increase the quantity. I can add it. You can see that for each and every specific product, we're having a different background image, which is looking nice for the specific product. So let me add this one. All right. So increase the quantity and add it. And let me jump to the card screen now. If I hit the card screen and there you can able to see all the products, whatever we added for the quantity, the single price and for the for the for the quantity number two, we have the calculations made perfectly over there and you can see the total shipping and overall the grand total. So let's say if I want to remove this specific product, all I have to use this gestures, I need to swipe right. So that product will be deleted from our cart and the quantity and the items and the total everything will be calculated instantly so of course we are going to use the react native gestures handlers also in this tutorial and i'm going to show you everything how to build it from the ground so if you swipe it right i can you can see that the items and everything is being successfully calculated and everything we are not using the payment gateway maybe that's for next tutorial and in this uh, let me give you a recap what are the things that we are going to cover we are going to build a hybrid applications by using expo and the sanity.io and we are using the redex for our data stores and we are going to use the react native gestures for uh, handlers gestures handlers for uh, removing the item from the cart and we are going to use the bottom tab navigation which is custom built all right these are the things that we are going to learn in this tutorial so if you are so excited about this tutorial which is going to be uploaded within few days and let me know in the comment section what's your opinion if you haven't subscribed my channel please hit the subscribe button and hit the like button if you love this video and stay tuned i'm coming up with the more interactive videos.